Hi, I'm John, 68 and a half year old uh, former competitive swimmer. In fact, I don't think I ever stopped really swimming and that's part of the reason why I've had shoulder pro problems in, in both shoulders. It's worn them down over the decades. On Friday, that's uh, three, day, three days and about five hours ago, I had a reverse shoulder replacement. Um, this is the first time I've been able to take off the bandage, so we can take a look at that. But first, I'll, I'll show you this um, brace sling. It's really, really pretty fantastic. It's designed to really hold, hold your arm in snug. You can see it around the back and over the top. It's about four inches thick here at the arm and they want to keep it away from the body because that improves or reduces the stress on the shoulder that they're, they're trying to repair. I'll take this off so you can see how, how easy it is to do that. Um, taking it off, I've got to be really careful with my arm because it's pretty uh, just tender right now. Um, I can see you can't see that, but I have to support my arm because I still feel pretty beat up. But anyhow, you can see the scar or the, the cut. There's no redness. I think it's doing pretty, pretty good. And I took a shower and that felt, felt fine. I've been taking a Percocet um, pretty much every five hours. Sometimes I take two before I go to bed and then one thereafter to, to manage the pain. There really isn't much pain at all, um, except when I move a little bit, especially engage my core and getting up. But I can tell, I'm going to rest my arm on a stool here. I can tell that my um, the pain is decreasing because it, it, it seems like it's radiating less. It's getting more concentrated just in you know, this one spot that they, uh, they beat up. So I'm still uh, really taking it easy. Can't really do anything with my arm. We'll be in that brace for approximately six weeks. I have my first post-op in a week from now since uh, you know, we have this weekend. So I'll find out a lot more then. Um, I plan on posting perhaps weekly um, updates on my, my progress so you can all benefit from what my experience is. And obviously if you're looking at this video, you're probably considering this type of surgery. And what I saw from other, other uh, patient testimonials really helped me a lot in developing the confidence and courage to have a pretty significant surgery uh, of my own. So I hope you're enjoying these. Um, I'll be, uh, be in touch and uh, have a great day.